What's up guys, Sky Shadow 421 coming at you with yet another video review. This time of an update on my custom Transformers Prime G1 Soundwave and my custom Killer B. Now you guys have seen Soundwave and we'll do his update later. But the real the real focus is on Killer B. Now I've taken the Cosmic Fire Bumblebee mold. You know, the one with the devil eyes? <laughs> and I had taken a Dremel to his wings, scratched up his door, put some blue nail polish all over him, shaved out some sides, actually took a torch to that. I started cutting off and painting a lot of his body parts and details, because, and I also cut half of his head right there so you can see that eye clear he's supposed to be like a zombie and I'm not gonna call him zombie because someone already took that name I can't I for the life of me I, I can't remember what his name is but he's not zombie he's killer B he's supposed to look like a zombie but the thing is, he's actually been through so many battles. He was a clone of Bumblebee. And with the glowing red eyes and the nearly unsighted Autobot symbol, they thought he was a Decepticon, so they sent him out. He was cast out and he was um neither on he was always on the Autobot side, but they didn't know. So he was in so many battles, he got armor ripped off, he got pieces shaved off, he got cut off head blown off by a grenade he's basically so full of rage that he'll kill anything almost like a zombie except he's got a brain in his head he's very vicious now here's some of the detailing I put on him I removed the, that piece of armor right there from that side Jumbled off a lot. Cut off the back toes. Did a lot of cutting on the spoiler. Scratched up the windows. Cut the roof. A lot of scratches. So, there's what we'll be. We'll send him up to the back. And now, for the update on my prize custom. My favorite... My Prime G1 Soundwave. Now, you remember in my last review, uh, I didn't have that. Well, it's because he was hidden in a drawer. <laughs> I was looking for a menu for a pizza place, and I found him, and I'm like, Oh my god! Yes! So, I took, him, I took a little laser beak. I kept his face silver. Yes, this is his face. If you remember in the show, the visor was facing forward. That's not his face. That's his tail. People have been painting his butt as his head. <laughs> anyway, I added some black to the sides and some up here. A lot of red, because he's usually red. And I added this, <clears throat> excuse me, this yellow to it. So when he folds up, I tried to as best I could. But it sort of simulates the yellow lines on the square that was on G1 Soundwave's chest for his Cassetticons. Now, I am pretty excited about uh, his, other his other Cassetticon, Rumble, coming out in October. But I've actually read his bio. It doesn't mention Soundwave at all. Rumble! It, it, really? Come on. He looks awesome, but mention Soundwave. Anyway, I also took the um, first edition Bumblebee's gun. I painted it blue. And I added some red detailing as um, some Energon. I tried to make it, except for the red, I tried to make it look as best I could of his laser pistol from G1. Not his shoulder 
cannon, but his laser pistol that he holds. I remember the front was uh, white or silver, and I ran out of silver. And uh, the back was blue, but I just added the red as extra detailing. So there's that. There, okay. And also, I may or may not, leave in the comments if you want me to or not, I may cut off this collar and just put some white around his face to give him some more head articulation because right there. Head up, turn. It looks like he's going, say what? It's because the collar hinders his articulation. Leave in the comments section if you want me to cut off the collar or not, and I'll do another update on that. But, and I've also been able to get in a sweet pose with both Killer Bee and Soundwave. I'll do that right now. Yeah, that's right. Give me a quick overview of what I'm looking at. That's right. Killer B is not gonna be happy with a blaster round in between his optics. <laughs> anyway, guys, that's the end of my video review. I'm going to be taking a break for a little while because I have to read book, book for school. It's required, and it, I think it's bull, but whatever. Plus, Transformers Fall of Cybertron came out today, I'm going to be playing that till my thumbs are sore. <laughs> anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video review I of uh, my Transformers Dark of the Moon custom Killer Bee, and my update on Transformers Prime G1 Soundwave. Rate, comment, subscribe if you want to. This is Sky Shadow 421, signing off.